Hey what's up guys this is Dude Tech and welcome back with another new video. In this video I have another beautiful twist to share it with you guys. I hope you guys enjoy today's video. With that being said, let's get started. Panorama paper. So when you download the tweet, the tweet is going to be providing you with, you can add some additional different images for your springboard, each one individual. I'm going to be showing you guys how is that going to be work. So it's really beautiful tweet to download. Let me jump right now into the settings. All right. So under the settings, the first thing that you need to do to enable the tweak from here. And then after that, you can set the image that you want. So here, as you guys can see, the select image preview the image and delete the image so if i want to tap on select image it's going to be take me to my studio so i'm going to be select one of the images here for example this one here and then after that is going to be success so this one is set if you want to preview that image that you set select here and then as you guys can see so i'm going to be set four five images and then showing you guys how is that going to be work and as i told you guys this is one two three four it's up to seven images so after you finish from that you need to make sure to hit the respring your device so your device will be take the effect all right so after i done setting all the images this is how it looks like this is one and two and this is the third one here so i already set three pictures for you guys and this is how is that going to be work once you set the tweak using your iDevice really beautiful and nice tweak to download highly recommend you guys to download it there you go guys if you're looking for that kind of stuff go ahead and download panorama papers next what i have for you guys it's an icon shadow and then this tweak is really beautiful once you set it on your home screen is going to be give some shadow for your icons using your eye device for this week here you need to add a source which you will be finding in the description below for you guys i'm going to be showing you guys right now under the settings all right so jumping under the settings here so when you download the tweak the first thing I, if you want to enable the shadow for your icons just stop here enable that and then there is another option which is the enable shadows on the dock so if you want to enable that, it's up to you and then here you have more than slider so you can pick the effect from here and then after you finish from everything you need to just make sure to respin your device so your device will be take the effect so after I respring my device, can you guys can see there is some effect here, some shadow right behind every single icon that I have. Let me just bring that closer so you guys can see there is shadows right now here. And this is how it looks like when you download the tweak on your iDevice. You guys can see right now, right behind every single icon, there is a shadow right now. So this is what is that tweak is going to be providing you with. Highly recommend you guys to download the tweak. It's really beautiful. Give nice shadow for your icons. There you go, guys. Icon shadow. And next, what I have for you guys, it's Wi-Fi channel bar. So that tweak is going to be providing with a currently connected Wi-Fi channel and is going to be add that to your status bar. Let me just bring that closer so you guys can see here that is kind of number right now on my status bar. So this is what is that week is going to be providing you with is going to be add the connected channel for your. So it's going to be uh, showing you or you will be having a visual that your channel connected here uh, using the status bar. This is when you download the tweak uh, has nothing to configure. When you download is going to be work right away using your iDevice. There you go, guys. Wi-Fi channel bar. Next, what I have for you guys is a better shutdown. So when you download the tweak, the tweak is going to be providing you with this hood here for the power off and actually is going to be uh, giving you some action uh, and some features add with that. So as you guys can see, it's power off and reboot, respring, and then you can use the save mode as well. I'm going to be showing you guys under the settings. All right, guys, so when you download the tweak, the first thing that you need to do to enable the button here, if you want to disable that on your lock screen. And then as you guys can see, that is two style of the light and dark mode. You can use it here. And also if you want to run the safe mode here, so just enable that. And then if you want to disable that from your lock screen, just to enable the button here after you're done, you need to just go back to your 
a home screen and I'm gonna be hold the power button right now and then as you guys can see right now I use the dark style and it's really beautiful and nice so as I said it's gonna be providing you with a power off reboot and respring and save mode let me show you guys how it looks like if I want to jump and use the light one I'm gonna be press on my power button here and there you go this is the power off reboot respring and the save mode the both is really beautiful and nice once you use it on your iDevice highly recommend you guys to download this one it's really beautiful when you set it on your iDevice there you go guys better shut down And next what I have for you guys, Icon Border. So when you download the tweak, that tweak is going to be providing you with a beautiful set of your home screen icons. I'm going to be showing you guys how is that going to be looks like. So first under the settings here, the first thing that you need to do to enable the tweak here and then you can choose or you can set the, the color that you want for your round icon. I'm going to be showing you guys how to set that. Choose the red color here and then after that hit on the save changes here and respring your device. And there you go guys this is how the icons looks like right now and even you can customize more colors you can add the color that you want the color that your favorite color you can just add that into your icons it's a beautiful and nice set for your icons it's really beautiful and nice tweak to download it on your iDevice for this tweak right there you need to add a source which you will be found in the description below for you guys there you go guys icon border I hope you guys enjoyed today's video, if you liked the video please just like always give it a big thumbs up, subscribe for my channel for more videos, this is Dude Tech. catch you guys in the next video, peace.